hands up. Queen, sir. Books out. Queen, sir. Queens out. Folks out. Queens out. Axel. Okay, Hey, faster. Okay, again. Okay, one more time. Good, last section. Now, the first one year New Zealand Tao, this section, first we go just one, two times slow to get it moved. But this section is supposed to be fast and explosive. Okay? So that part, that's why they repeat it. And then we skip the warm up. Okay, we already do a lot of time with this move. So you want to be very fast and explosive on that one, right? That's why we skip the warm up and we'll do straight to the form. Okay, chunk cue, chunk cue.
Okay, good. <clears throat> good. All right. Good. BG. BG, not also BG is supposed to be very fast, but because uh, the first time we go in the group, we go normal speed first to make sure everything is good. The ship is good. All right. So first time, we're going to go three times. Okay. First section, go easy and then go fast. Okay. And then second good. part, same, go slow and then go fast. And then the last one too. So we don't want to go fast right away. We want to go easy first, okay? Uh, so uh, yeah, so section by section, section one first, slow and then fast, okay? So section one, okay? section one so especially when Francesco do it you want to go not too fast okay if you were fast you want to be like like people will it's going to be messed up so go fast but try to keep that okay all right we go that first part a bit faster you don't have to follow see when you go in your own time okay all right do that a bit faster Second section. First time, go slow. Look at your hand. Turn. Shift. So when you do this move, you shift or look over there. Follow. You ship that, we don't look to the front, we we'll follow that. Yeah? Okay. All right, no count. Okay, go.
Okay, good. Last section. Slow again. One, two, three. Turn your hand. Chop. Hold to the front. Take your hand. The other side. One, two, three. Turn. Chop. Hold to the front. Good. Yeah. Okay, push, catch. Move, strike, drop hand, hit, catch. Okay, good. Do the last part again, a bit faster. Uh, uh, just, just, yes. one yeah. just, just one question. Uh, sec in section three, uh, about Luigi, this part here, when you bring your hand out, I, I notice when you do it, you first hand, then under. I, I do it, same time. W uh, which one is right? Block first. <coughs> block first. Block. And then this. Yeah. Block first, right, Ben? And then this. Yeah. Okay? Why do the same oh. time? You block me, put it at the same time. When the guy pulls your hand, it's going to be stuck. <laughs> I, thought that, I, I, thought, I thought in this case, it would be like, you know, I block, and then until the guy does, doesn't grab the elbow, my hand is here to protect. Ah, now what do you think? Now, when you block this one, man, this hand. Okay, watch. If I do like this, right? Yeah, I yeah. like this. How about yeah. my face? What block my face? This hand is here. This hand is back here, man. Beauty is one hand blocking. It. It's like Usao, yeah. right? One hand, you block. Is that right? And then when yeah. you do this, it breaks in the guy's hand if he rock your hand. If you put it right away, and he put your face in this hand right here, what? His hand wasn't right. here. His hand blocked here. This hand is here. Okay, they can go down. They can go here, right? So your first one, you block there. Beauty, yeah, in the fight. The hand in the center, one block. Then he wrap your hand, this one is going to be break. Break, right? Right, right, right. You right away from here. Where is the hand protect your face? Yeah, here, yeah. Ah, yeah, but well, you don't put it here. If I go right away from here, what if he punch from this, right? Your hand is right, here. Right. Yeah, your hand is there. Your hand is here. And then when you do this, you're gonna move your hand there, okay? Yeah, okay. don't put it right away. All right, okay, guy. All right, last one. Okay, go. Jonathan, so what do we need that with that timing like that? We do one more time. Because uh, when you do that, so what do we that? Last one together. The same with uh, same with Jonathan, it'll be uh, with faster. Last one, ready? Set, go. Always practice the same at home. Don't go fast right away. Go to the first one, check your hand is good, head's good, and then we'll go fast, okay? Got it. Hong Chong. Hong Chong. One to four, go just one to four, not hard. Five, six, seven, eight, go slow. One to four, go normal speed. Ready? We we'll start from here. Okay, one to four. Okay, go. Second. Third. 
Evet. Ford. You okay with that, Contesio? Good. All right, guys. Five, six, seven, eight. Go slow. One by one. Okay, five. Six. So for just go around seven, seven, right? Okay, all right. Just wait and me, Jonathan, and Ben go session eight. Okay. okay. second two of the cylinder with the guy grab your hand or let's say this out they trap your hand they trap your hand they hit your hand like this trap right okay don't fight with hand on the top one push push it good so learn practice one all like this anytime you push you move your legs too is that the section one and section two when you have the hand like this one out right so learn like that in this out your hand stuck one hand on the top. All right, the hand on the top, turn there. Okay, don't turn like, okay. All right, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Hand on the top, uh, arm on the top, yeah, yeah, true. Hand on top, turn like this, yeah? Yeah, on top, good. You have the hand on the top, turn there. So when you're on top, you turn like this, you're using this hip, yeah? Do that, practice that. One out, one out, hmm? Good. When you go from here, now this hand on top, then when I push this leg, go there. So get the power. Yeah. Work like that. Work like that. Turn around. So block, push, block, push. All right. After you push the person, he trap you, you push. How do you hit them? How do you hit them? We did that before. How do you strike them? How do you strike them? Is that on a wooden dummy? No, no, no. Don't need on a wooden dummy. Ji Sao, you wrap your hand, you push him away. And how do you hit? How do you hit? Go around. Go around. Oh, bye. That could be one option. Okay. Whew. We have that on section, uh, what is that? Uh, six? Six, you can yeah. Push him away. What other move you do? After I do this. Look. Here is one. Here. Hit this one. Here is two. Right? Hit. Hit elbow if you want to okay so one that's it's one that's it's two elbow two right so work like that guy here the top on the hand hit first this one is good that elbow is good or you can turn here 
He then turned back whole pie. Uh, section six, you can do all of those. Section six, yeah. And when you turn the hand like that, you reverse that hand and push him away. That's section six. You can use that, okay? Work like that, hand trap, open, hit one, hit, turn around, throw the guy or bottom, hit it, elbow, perfect. Hit one, two, elbow, pull pie, push. A lot of those move. That's from Fang Sao, use a lot. Use a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. This is also one of the technique we don't use unless fighting on the street. Okay, Quan Sao, you see it here? Yeah. I hit one, slap to the groin. Okay, that unless, real fight, I don't care. As long as you win, look, one, hit one, slap him, and hit, right? You can use that because the low hand bomb, it was low right here. I can hit one, I can hit two, I can elbow that three, and then you do, you know, that's another, okay. Yeah. yeah. This one right here, elbow right here, slap to the groin right here, and then fax out. Many moves you can do with that technique. Good. All right? We're doing one of the mistake. No. No one else can even, no one else can even die. All right, guys, go back. We're working on this. All right. I want you working on the balance, okay? So when you move, balance. Yeah? So from here, we'll go forward. Okay? So we'll learn like this. Let's say most of the time we'll let Jipsao and then you guys waiting. Somebody coming to throw the attack, right? We, all, we will be learn if I know he's going to fight me, especially like you go for him. <laughs> You're not gonna wait, all right? The guy plays your hand, you slide forward. All right, so we'll practice that. Slide forward, and then, and then go for the attack. So learn to be that step in chop kill, and fast forward. Make sure we can, we can attack, right? Good, like from here, slide, punch it. Do that, do that. Good, good. Um, slide, attack, punch it. Good, <clears throat> right? Good. Forward, in front, and go. Oh. All right, what if you do this? You're about to do this, and the person hook punch. So we're gonna add it in like this. Shoot, tanda, tanda, right? If you go attack him, and it's not hooking. So we're gonna go here, forward, tan, tan, right away, okay? Learn that, don't go like this. Tan, catch hand. Bong, that's bad. Catch and hand miss. Bong, gonna be dangerous. Tan, tan, and then hit. So work like that. Move. Tan, tan, go in, and elbow. That's a lot faster. Go here, slide forward, tan, so, tan, so. Few punch, elbow. That's a lot faster than you try to lap or elbow, none of those stuff. Lap so, bong so. It's only for chi so fighting. It's not for street fighting. In the distance, you don't want to use any of the bong. It's too slow, right? Block and then hit is slower. We're using a long weapon first. Bill, jut, tan, gan, jut, bill. Those are fast use first, okay? Good. All right, another one. I kick, the guy run away from me. I kick, then I, I will do move number. Section four, follow up with side, side kick, bong sao. I do one, he move, I do this, and then I stay forward, step forward. Work on that. Front kick, tan sao, he move, bong sao, side kick, and then chase it. Yeah, work on that. Front kick, side kick, bong sao, go forward. That's good, there you go. Do that a few, so you can know how to do attack. On, Side, forward, like that. Yes. Okay, that's what I ask you. Have you ever tried side kick first in a fight? I saw Ben do that all the time when you do jibs out here on the task. Ben tried to, because what we learned karate and stuff, we like side kick. Jonathan likes side kick too, right? All right. Yeah. When I've done that. It, when do you use it correctly? Because, look, in karate tournaments, no problem, right? <laughs> but with Wen Chang, 
you guys know this? The guy right here, who in big trouble. So, yeah, yeah. Is that notice, right? In karate, two, no, no, no problem. You do psychic, the guy run back. I come in, you don't have any problem at all. But yeah. if you see the guy who do jujitsu, when jump, they wait for you to do psychic. By the time you do, yeah, he's going to be right here. What do you do? Yeah. Can you turn around and hit him? No. Now he's going to go very close. He wrap it with big trouble. So when is a good time Wing Chun use psychic first in Wing Chun? When is the time? Give me an example. What do you think is the best time to use a psychic to attack first? When you're close. Close? Yeah. Why don't like, you like to break the legs? Yeah, you're kicking no, the like, leg, but let, let's return. Like you're on the side of, no, like you're on the side of him and you can... Oh, you're on the side like this. You kick psychic, right? Yeah. Good. I cannot hit you. That's a good one. What else? What else would you psychic? What when else? the guy has his back turned, when the guy, like, you know, uh, you're fighting, he has his back turned. Back turned? Yeah, yeah. When you're, when the guy you're fighting, you know, okay. instead of his in front, the face is behind. So, so you can kick or side kick. You can kick or side kick. No, I said when you can use a side kick first, not the front kick. Yeah, 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 yeah. yes. So, so, so when the guy uh, you're fighting has his back turned, has his back, like, he's not facing you. He's not facing. So it's back like this? Yeah. And then you do side kick? You could. You, you could also do a front kick if you want. Uh, you, uh, you could do both. That's who asked when is a side kick is a, is a, it's a good option. It's a benefit when you should do side kick. The situation. Jonathan, go any anything you think? I, I know he likes psychic. He likes uh, take one to psychic. Yeah, like that, right? When? When, Jonathan? You don't want a guy kick you down there. He wouldn't kick you down there when you do hiking. When is a safe one to do that? Real. When they're tired? When they're tired? And their arms are down? They're open? If open? What do you mean why they're open? How they're open? They're in a fight, right? No, they're tired and they're like, they're struggling to keep their arms up, so they're very. You know, they run it. See if if, they, if if you're fighting, right? Hmm. They come close and they come close for the swing. Can't you kick low? Oh, that's good one. That's it. Yeah, he come through like to you like this, and I, hey, I move my head away, right? Can he do this? Okay, look, look, look. You're gonna go like this to you, right? So instead of I'm gonna go like this, I'm gonna move it away. Ah, so we do this. You wanna move away and low kick them. That's a good one. That's it, Jonathan. That's a good one because. When he do that to you and you do front kick, it's a little scary, isn't it? The pun go right to your face. Are, are you gonna wanna do this? No. I'm moving my face away. It's like it's like I'm moving away, right? That move you have in section four, wooden dummy. Remember low bomb? This way, look, that sideways, right? We don't go. So we go here, we go, and then he go back, pun, you lean back. Okay. All right, I don't know if that move in uh IP Man movie. Must be, must be. Watch it, must be. So if he go like this to a face, I'm moving away. Look, I'm moving, could be like this. I'm moving, I put my elbow up, then I'm kicking. So the worst so thing, he got my elbow, right? Then you can move it away, throw them the low kick, get them in the leg. That will be a good option. What else? So like part four in the wooden dummy? Sorry? Like the like in for the fourth part of the wooden dummy, wooden dummy form? Yeah, one. Forward, yeah, and then lean back. There you go. You lean back when the guy, you lean back, bring your elbow up. So if he punch you in the elbow, fine, no problem. But I don't want to go like this when he punch me in the face and I do front kick. That's the danger. But if you move it away, you throw like this, and then you break his low leg, that's okay to go side kick safe. All right? What else? What else? Another situation. When right away you can use psychic and it's effective. When the guy runs away, when he yeah. when he when he begins to walk away, he runs like this. Him? Yeah, chase him. Yeah, but in the fight, if he run away and I'm like this, he run away. Why don't you chase him? Why don't you turn to a psychic? Right? You psychic man. The way I go here man, run, I go psychic because a fun kick you run right. But if I didn't kick yeah. yet, I do like this and you run away. Should I go side kick? Or should I just chase you and, and, and do front kick? Front kick faster. Right. right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, how about this? You guys go key out. You guys wrap your hand and pull. Is that when you do side kick? Yeah. You wrap your hand and pull. Right? You wrap your hand and pull. How do you do front kick? How do you front kick? Stuck. Now, because he pull you, 
right? Look, you pull your hand, you fall like this. What kick will come out? Take it, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Can you do fun kick when he pull your arm? Can you do fun kick when he pull your arm? I don't think no. like fun kick work, right? Just go here, you do this. I go, go, chi so I take your hand and pull you like this. Can you do fun kick? No. Yeah. Fun kick won't work. That's where you see the side kick, right? Get a situation now, he pull. I want to kick him, I have to turn back, which is no, not enough time. So I pull him, I kick him, he let me go. Is that right? Yeah, he let me go. Yeah. Okay, your body turn, remember, Francesco. You do this, your body turn, and that's why you do side kick, right? If your body in front of him, he pull me here, I can kick him, I can knee him, right? This one is he pull me sideways. Lap song, he pull like this, and I kind of off, I kind of kick. So pull your side and kick him, he let you go. That the only few situation when a side kick is good. Now we will start the spa like this in a karate tournament with jumping, and then you can throw the first side kick. No good. It kind of, you gotta be really fast, otherwise people can take advantage of you, right? Ah, right. so it will be fun kick to start. That one will be better. Or it could be fake fun kick, to make that they move, then you can throw side kick. So if John doesn't like side kick, do like that. Fake them, fishing them with the front kick, yes? All right, so they're about to block it, now you turn to side kick and kick, okay? There you go. And after those side kick, all right, I asked Jonathan, he like to do back kick, right, Jonathan? Show the back kick, back kick, all right. Let me ask Jonathan, when you use the back kick? Again, don't tell me you were facing the guy. Yeah. Yeah. No, only, do that when he's, only do that when he's tired. You, you can finish him <laughs> off with that. <laughs> All right. Again, in Taekwondo, no problem. In Taekwondo, we throw back kick and, right? In karate, same, right? I run it away. I jump away. So if you don't hit me, you're still safe. But not with Wing Chun and not with Jiu Jitsu guy. By the time you turn like this, they will end. So, so careful with that one. If you don't do a fast back kick, don't do it. It's the most scary kick. You might be missed and he go in, boom, boom, behind your head and you're on the floor, right? Practice it for fun. Not gonna do it unless the guy, you kick him one, all right? So look, hit, boom, he's like this. All right, then you turn around, go kick. It doesn't matter, he have no time to catch your leg and he cannot hit you back, right? Then if you want a back kick, it's fine. Back kick, jump kick, flying kick, flying knee, it's only used at that time, okay? The rest of them never use it on the street. Have you ever seen the fight with a guy running forward, jump kick, and he fall by himself? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Nobody hit him. Yeah, Nobody fall hit him. On the ground, he hit his head. <laughs> never do that. <laughs> it happened. It happened. Or back kick, and then you, you are balling, and then boom, one shot. Never do that. It's not in the fight. In tournaments, yes. The tournaments have some rule. They don't let people hit you bad when you do those kicks, right? but not yeah. on the street. The street is bad. You jump it, you fall on the floor by yourself. That was, right? So really it's not a favor of Wing Chun. Wing Chun never do that. Wing Chun only want to do something safe, you know, safe and then quickly get out of it, right? Before they get wrap you, go to wrestling, we're both on the floor, no good, okay? Yeah. All right, so, so that's what you do. Now I want to go back, we work on this move. Okay, so I go in, I throw the, the technique, I'm throwing one you guys do like a jib so boom 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 and hit. Okay? So we go slow first. If I go and I do the jab, how do you block? Good. How do you flow from there? Yeah, jab beauty. Go lap and elbow punch. Good. This is what the guy do this. Come on. This? Come on. And this. And do careful. Good. Try again, Francesco. This and this. Powder flow. Good job. Now on the street, but the guy do this. Don't go, don't do bomb because they're very close here, right? Don't do bomb. So deal, time, something that quick. All right. How about this? They do this to your face, and they go low down to your belly. How do you block those? Yeah, to your face, and then down here. Just go. What is that here? Yeah, one high. You go build one low. You can do gap. It's fine. Here you go. This, this, one, and then go flow attack. Good. Okay, careful with that one. Again, there you go. If you think this one go too fast and I don't want to do any thing, what other thing? Emergency. What other thing you do and make sure it's getting? In Chunky, right? Bong, psychic. Bong, psychic. We talked before. Can I do this? Do this. 
Di ay moon away. Take him. Look. Yeah. Di ay moon. Cool. Aha. Take your hand up. Look. Then. Look. Yeah. Careful. Bang. Throw him the kick because we don't want to be blocked. So from here, here, right? Good. All you can see, scary. Block. Have a block and give him a kick to the leg. That happened, right? Okay. Chung Q. Uh, what about Chung Q? Can't you uh, elbow down? Yeah. 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 Boom. Be down. It's good too. Elbow down. Not this down. Elbow down, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah. Elbow. The kick. Wouldn't Chung like to use an elbow to block the kick? They don't like this to block the kick. They don't like to do this because you guys will miss it, right? It could be a fake. You get to the face. So this is good. That's one good. Take the elbow. Take your elbow. Good. Okay, now. Okay, we'll turn here. Now you want to throw that kick. How do you block that kick? Then? Come on. How do you block this? What kick? Now, uh, Bando, that pretty good. Why do Han Sao? Han Sao? Okay, that's good. Okay, well, you have Han Sao from Jonathan. I have Han Sao from Francesco. Now, my question. Why do you do this? Right? All right. What kick do you think? What block you're going to block? Okay. Han Sao, Han Sao. How about why Francesco do Bong Sao? Uh, Han Sao, tell me. Why you turn like this? Because your arm is getting, you're blocking the whole kick, aren't you? Okay. Okay, tell me honestly, have you ever tried to block the guy with Han Sao? Have you no. ever tried? Scary Francesco, he kick in hard and you turn, he kick here, you turn your face toward to the kick. Pretty scary, right? Unless yeah. that guy not a kicker. Unless that guy kick like this. Quick, I will take him, no problem. But the guy kick like a, like a take one on karate kick, I don't want to turn my face toward to a kick. What if he's go, it crushed your hand to your face. This way, can't so better because when you turn like this, you got two elbows, right? Yeah? Or you turn it away. You turn it away from the kick and then you kick the other leg. That more safe. Yeah? When do we use the Fanta like Francesco? When the best to use that technique? Francesco didn't do that. Right? When? Is that like when he's holding your hand, like, he, like he's holding your hand? You I'm normal kick, your... normal kicking. Again, the kick. Oh, kick. I don't, I don't yeah. Know. When, when do you guys use the Fanta? When the guys are right. Hmm? When the guy is a bad kicker. Okay, number one, he's a bad kicker. You can still throw like a, like that of bad kick. I will take him. All right. And then number two, we're not talking about bad kicker. Number two, this guy a good kicker. You got a good kicker. Fast. When you can use this? When? You're close. When you can uh, step in. When you can. When you can. When, yeah, as Jonathan said, when you're close. When, when you're you close. In. Perfect. Uh, when I was here. And then suddenly, and my face turned this way, and he throw the kick. So I, I do, boom, I do this. He get it close, I bring it up, and I, I break his, his leg, no problem. He close, right? But if he form a little bit like a kickboxing guy, swing the kick, I will do this. I will do this. It's scary, right? I will do this. Right, Francesco? Yes? So if you're far away kick, I will move this way. I will move that way, right? I will move away from the kick. Let's hurt. And then I kick, yes? But if I'm closer, if you get closer, closer like this, and then suddenly he brings his legs up, I will stay. I will take it. All right, but it has to be closed because when they close, it not hurt that bad. You got it? Yeah? Yes. And also when they close in, I do this with my with my low push, shoot. My low kick hit him too. So he fall back. He didn't he didn't he didn't get a kick to my face, right? But if he fall away and I do this. And I kick him, his leg will get here first before my leg. That kind of risky. Okay, if that person is a black belt take one, don't kick you. I think your hand gonna hand gonna break, right? Gonna break your yeah. bone. No. So one saw it kind of like that. It kind of a little bit scary. The many block and Win Chong. Win Chong can do this as well. You know that? For example, the guy come kicking, you know, can you can bring your elbow like this. Protect your head, elbow down, and this hand like this. Yeah? The guy kick him, you take this, look, here. He kick it here. So you move it, you know, to your hand, you take your hand and hold your hand like a boxer, but like this. One hand here. So you move like this, right? He go in, he kick that, it, he got him. Yeah? Yeah, but wouldn't that hurt you more than them? Because wouldn't your elbow be hitting his, uh, like, shin? Yeah? Listen, elbow hit the shin, 
It hurt, but it's not bad. Then you put in something like, uh, yeah, the, when you get here, you get to this, right? It's just same like, get hook, I do time. I take my elbow, right? Yeah, I don't want to take my, uh, uh, this, this hurt, yeah, this hurt, but go to the elbow, do this. Why he kick it yeah, out? If, you, if, you, if you're hitting your elbow, your bone onto his bone, wouldn't that hurt you more than him? No, I mean, no, depend. Hurt. Come on. If his shin kick again, depend on how far is the kick. If the, the distance is long, understand? Long, and that guy throwing the very long kick, you put your hand up, it hurt. I'm talking about close. Right? When it close, oh. in band a bit right here. I just go in. When you kick, you don't stay and put your hand up, right? As he kick, you move close in. So he missed, he missed it. This one never hit his shin. They hit it a bit inside, a bit closer to there somewhere, right? It's not to the shin. You move in, ah, then you actually go in, yeah? But again, the more you do later on, when you do sparring, you are practicing, okay? Then you will find what exactly the time when you use those techniques. Those techniques need to be fast too, right? Let's say you're a bad blocker. You're a bad blocker. The guy is a good kicker. You're a bad blocker. He kicks so hard, you slowly bring your hand up. Oh, I'm sure you're gonna dislocate your shoulder because you're slow. But if you're fast, you're moving quick. When the guy bring the leg, you're moving in quick. Okay, that's a different story, right? And again, when you go outside with sparring, you have to see, depending how the guy throw the kick. First, to be safe, move first, see how he goes. Okay, you this first. You see, if the guy is a good kicker, like you can see he's a good kicker, or the guy is a bad kicker. <laughs> All right, then, then I will decide to do this, right? If it's a good kicker, move it, move it, look like he do uh, some of the good kicking fast, be careful. Those one, I want to use my leg. I want to step away, break his leg. I don't want to use my hand to, uh, to block him, right? If he's a good kicker, he kick fast, it's a lot of fake move. We don't want to use a hand, okay? I just say it like this, Jiu-Jitsu guy. Jiu-Jitsu people like to pick people catching the leg, right? Catching the leg and throwing down. Who are they gonna catch? Are they gonna catch a person who don't have to kick? Take it. Are they gonna be kicked and try to catch a person who block well? No, they don't want it because it hurt. That guy kick it fast and heavy. So in this case, they don't want it. Or the wind chunk push, boom, quick. They don't want to catch that kick, right? They want to kick with some guy throwing the kick kind of little, like that, unbalanced, that will take you right away because they know it, not hurting, right? So the more you do the drill, it all depends on the more experience, but Wing Chun likes to use a leg to stop. Leg to stop. When you're really good, then you use your hand. So Wing Chun say leg for legs, hand for hands, right? Okay? So only emergency, I will use a hand to block the kick. If, if it's too fast and I'm close, I might be relied on my hand, but leg for leg, hand for hand, leg for leg, that's the winchong rule. Use your foot, use your heel, kick him. That way you won't hurt, right? Okay? Good, good. Okay, working on that. Go through all the form. When you see me, mostly cheese out, yes? Yeah. And here, we do form, we do some drill. Make sure you understand when I throw something, we're not going to go wrong. Ah, so you react like the same with one chips out. We can play online like this. But when you come in, real key out, right? And weapon, okay? Yeah. All right. Good. Back in line.